Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to lock the screen of your iPad Pro. So I'm not talking about pressing the power button so you know it locks, okay? What I'm talking about is locking it so that if you're in, let's say, the Notes app, the iPad will not exit the Notes app. Or locking the touch screen so you cannot touch the iPad Pro. Uh, so you know, you see me swiping here, that swiping will not work. Okay, so to get this started, open up the Settings app. From here, you want to find Accessibility. If accessibility is not here, then tap on general and then accessibility will be there. So just tap on accessibility. You're gonna scroll down until you see guided access. Tap on guided access and turn it on. So this is very important. You're gonna see this text here and it's gonna say to, and, uh, to start guided access and it's gonna give you a key combination you need to use. So in my case, the key combination is to triple click the top button in the app I want to use. For you, it may say triple click the home button or it may give you a key combination you need to use. So very important that you understand what this key combination is. The top button for me is the power button here, okay? Uh, if it's different for you, just keep that in mind. So we have the password settings. So you can set password if you would like to. Boom, we we'll use that. You have the time limits, stuff like that. You can mess around with these settings. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go home and I'm going to select an app I want to enable guided access in. So that app cannot be settings, okay? Can be any other app though. So let's say Twitter. Don't know why you'd want to lock yourself in Twitter, but just for the sake of the video, now we need to enable guided access. So remember that key combination earlier for me, it was triple clicking the top button here. Okay, so I'm going to triple click one, two, three, and now guided access will be enabled. If in a situation where it doesn't enable, again, just check the key combination you need to do and you'll be good to go. Okay, so from here, you have the options. So you can have motion on, keyboard on, touch on. So if you just want to have it locked so where touch doesn't work, you can turn that one off. You don't want keyboards to work, turn that one off. Same with motion, all that good stuff. You also have a time li limit if you want that on, cool. Then you also have here circle areas on the screen you would like to disable. So go like this, boom, and you can see it will add an area of the screen which I cannot access. So everywhere the circle isn't here, I can access this part of the screen, but in that circle, the touch will not work. You can also drag it. You can also change, you know, the, the circle. Cool, but if you do want to again, disable the full touch, just turn this one off and then everything will be disabled. Now, when you're ready, tap on start. And now it says guided access started. So now you can see my fingers on the screen. I'm tapping it, you can see the iPad's you know, jol jolting back and nothing is working because we have now locked the screen of our iPad Pro. But how, how do we unlock it, right? Because right now we're kind of stuck. Well, it's very simple. You're going to use the same Triple click combination, was it the home button, was it the power button? That was already showing the setting, so just triple click for me, it's the top button. So I'm gonna do one, two, three, boom. It's gonna ask for the passcode to disable the guided access. You have the option to end or resume. I'm just gonna tap on end, and there we go, guided access has been ended. So now you can see here, boom, you know, I exited the app, I did everything, and yeah, you're good to go. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later, bye bye.